All right, YouTube subscribers, my name is Ray Sean, known as Ray Niz on Facebook, also known as Mr. Ceiling Fan Man 1999 on YouTube. Now, what's going on is that I'm showing you guys my 50 Torrance Polish Brass Hampton Bay Landmark Ceiling Fan. Now, this is the first ceiling fan in the year of 2024 that I've picked up so far. Now, this is the ceiling fan that I got from a lady's house. And the reason why she wanted the ceiling fan to be replaced, because the ceiling fan looked outdated and it did not even match the decor of her house. And also because of the ceiling fan has a broken blade bracket, sadly, and stuff. And as you can see that this piece right here that looks just like that, the other side is broken off and all that stuff. So I'm going to have to go on and find some replacement blade brackets for this fan. But I'm going to just go on and just replace all five of them and all that stuff. Just for the just to keep this fan balanced, like on the balance side of things and all this. Well, just so, just so I can keep the ceiling fan balanced and all that stuff, like on the balancing side of things and stuff. And then the next thing is, so um, I'm about to go on to tell the information about this fan. Now, the information about this ceiling fan is that um that this ceiling fan is a CEI made ceiling fan. So um. Hold on, excuse me. I'm I'm having brain farts, so you just have to go. You just gonna have to excuse my brain farts. So, and I yeah, because see, I forgot to mention that um, she let me on uh, replace the ceiling fan with another Hampton Bay ceiling fan called the Bellina. I also forgot to mention that it's paint splatters on the cane side of the blades too. Now the Hampton Bay Bellina ceiling fan. It kind of looks like a redesigned version of a Hampton Bay Middleton. And the model number for that Hampton Bay Bellina is a UE42, which is the same model number that's the Middleton. But uh, but I'm going to talk about all that in another subject. So uh, going back to this fan, so the information about this fan is that this ceiling fan has five reversible blades from Kane, which is what you're looking at right now. And the other side is just plain. And then the next thing is that um, then this fan is three speeds and it's electrically reversible. Features a three-speed pull chain switch and a four to reverse switch. And the ceiling fan is very versatile as you can install the ceiling fan with or without a light kit. But um, if you would have got the ceiling fan brand new in the box from factory, it would have never came with the light kit. So the light kit is just to add on to the fan. And as you can see that the globes on this light kit is actually a hammer clear glass. Now these globes are not original to the light kit, but these are the globes that actually came with the fan, but they definitely not original to the fan. And then I don't know about the center globe light kit. As you can see, it got a little mark on it, but I got to see if that can actually come off or not. But this ceiling fan got to get all cleaned up. But I did partially clean the ceiling fan and stuff as I was taking it apart. And the reason why is that because uh, when I was carrying the ceiling fan and stuff, dust is getting all over me and all that stuff. And all this dust that came from this ceiling fan right here. So all this dust is getting all on my coat and stuff. So um, other than that, you're just going to have to excuse the dog barking and stuff. So um, something else I forgot to mention about this fan is that uh, due to the fact that the file number for the ceiling fan is E8951CE. This ceiling fan was manufactured by CEI, which stands for Composites Industries. And this ceiling fan was made in Thailand back in January of 1993. And as you can see that this fan has some um, bearing noise to it as I spin the motor. Yeah, these bearings are really noisy and stuff. And the bearings are really stiff and stuff. So um, so I'm just going to uh, partially restore this fan and stuff and clean the ceiling fan out. And I'm just uh, remove, like spray some WD-40 onto the bearings and stuff to actually uh, loosen up the bearings on and stuff. So other than that, I'm about to go on and get off this video. And now the reason why the lady let me have this fan because I asked her if I could have it. And she told me that I could have it because she was about to throw it away. So um, other than that, I'm about to go on and get off this video. So this is Ray Nizzle signing out this video.
and I'm known as Mr. Ceiling Fan Man 1999 on YouTube. My name is Rayshawn Willis, and I am off this video. I also forgot to mention that the ceiling fan also came with the tassel pull, and then this one it just came some came with this random pull chain and stuff, which is something I'm gonna replace with a better chain and stuff. And then I also forgot to mention that the original mounting bracket for this fan is not present because I forgot to bring the original mounting bracket with me and stuff just for me to show in the video. But I still do have it in my hands and stuff. But I just got, I, I, I bought the mounting bracket with me as far as me um taking it home with me and stuff. It's just that I was just too lazy to um pull the original mounting bracket out of my toolbox and all that stuff. And bring it with the fan and stuff. But, but, um, but when I do a demonstration video of the ceiling fan, I'm going to have the original mounting bracket. Because I did not forget to, um, because I did not forget to, um, bring the mounting bracket with me with the fan. It's just that I just left it, it's just that I left it in my own house and stuff. But, um, other than that, but, um, but I do have the original mounting bracket for this fan just for me to, um, cut the long story short. That I just forgot to mention and stuff. Then also forgot to mention that the light kit is also missing its third screws on each fitter and all that stuff. So, um, other than that, I'm about to go on and on get off this video. And then as you can see that I did spray CD40 onto the bearings and stuff. So I'm about to get off this. So I'm about to go on and on just um, get off this video.